So, I want to say this really quickly. So, I'm in lovely Atlanta, and of course, it's 2 o'clock and there's traffic, right? Why is it that when there's traffic, it always seems like that the lane that you in is the slowest lane, right? And all the other lanes are faster. And then you get over into that lane, and then that lane slow up, and the one you was in is faster. I will never understand that. People really, it really feels like that sometimes in life. Like, you look at somebody else's things that they have or the route that they're taking or maybe their relationship whatever and it always seems particularly in relationships and it seems like theirs is better than yours and here's the interesting part and particularly inside of relationships I will say a lot of times you think that somebody else's relationship is better than yours when in actuality if you were to get over inside of that relationship and ask them they either think that your relationship is better or they will completely disagree with the um you know, the, the kudos or whatever that you're giving them for their relationship. And so, I and it made me just think, that's why a lot of times people just need to stay in their own lane. Stay in your own lane with the guard and, and work on your relationship as hard as you can and maximize and, and, and push to make it the best it can be. Because when you keep switching and doing all this, it don't work like that. And when your mind, a lot of times, is just switching up and and looking at other things that you shouldn't be looking at. It's different if you're walking from a path of personal development, but to covet or want what somebody else has instead of just sitting in your own lane and your own relationship and working and maximizing, that's not gonna work. So the moral for today is stay in your own lane.